Hello and welcome to What's Up Rayclast. If you want to stuff your six sockets full of news, you've come to the right place. If you're still having Vietnam-esque flashbacks to the download speed of 11.4, fear not. 11.5 isn't nearly as large. If you're a fan of Bear Grylls-like farming methods, you might have to mix up your build. Cooldowns of all same skill gems are now linked. No more 24 bear trap hotkey glory. The cooldown reduction more than makes up for this, allowing you to use your best linked traps more often. The microtransaction store sees a new skin transfer consumable. You can make any item look like any other item, and you don't have to wait for the full moon. There are obvious slot constraints. You can't make a pair of shoes look like a sword, or put pants in your head. Although I think this would be a great artistic leap forward. Make it happen, Mr. Wilson. I'll definitely be picking this up so I can always look like the tricorn rocking Jack Sparrow Captain Hook badass I am. You can now access the store from your game client, reducing the amount of reasonable reasons to exit the game to zero. 11.5 added five new uniques. Poor Joy's Asylum proves to be better than meds, offering a tough challenge for tasty rewards. The most interesting stat has got to be the unique boss drop modifier. Divining this piece of geographical real estate changes the amount and item type dropped. While I'm not sure in the parameters, I'll be burning all my currency in the hopes of a plus 100 rare tricorn party. Sybil's Paw Thresher Claw provides a helping hand for those long days threshing crops in the fields. It also offers an insane life on hit with spells, whack on incinerate with a multiple projectile mod and drown yourself in the sweet red refreshment. If you like your explosions up close and personal, the Quacholly Spiked Maul is for you. Whilst it may just look like an acorn resting on top of a bean sprout, this vegetable looking stick of death should provide your levelling with much needed vitamins. Who needs a good technique when you have a King Kong endorsed maul behind you? Kongar's undying rage terror maul ensures that every one of your hits connect. While crits with this monkey don't do any extra damage, they give you a 20% increased movement, attack and cast speed. Get your crit chance stacked and show Ray Clash your turbo mod. The final new unique is one for all you zombie lovers out there. Montreal's Grasp Void Scepter reduces the amount of moulding friends you have, but makes those most loyal to you into a tough zombie A team. Get ready to sit back and wave goodbye to all the monsters your zombies are eating up. That's your news for this week. I hope you're all enjoying Race Season 4 as much as myself. If you haven't experienced the sandy overdose that is the Endless Ledge, really do try and schedule it in. Till next week, see ya!